all right so we said we had some projects we were working on so i am going to introduce well reintroduce you guys have seen this car this is project Rosholt car number one check her out this is a 90 i believe it's a 96 i'll have to double check with adam but i'm pretty sure it's a 96 chevy cavalier this car has been run four times. It's got a heat and a feature at a compact team show last year. And then two one and dones. It got one trophy at the end. This thing ran Rochelle last year and it took second place. It's on our cover photo. Uh, it's also on our One Goose Vinyl Company Facebook page. Um, but why am I intro in this car if it is... The car that Adam got a trophy in. Well, Adam's afraid of it. <clears throat> Adam wanted to take this thing to the junkyard. He said it was done. It was used up. He wasn't going to run it anymore. Ignore the second tank in there. That's just something I'm borrowing to somebody else. He said the floor was coming in too far. Getting too close to the tank. And that the front frame, I'll show you that, was just too far gone. Oh. What do you think? <laughs> is that too far gone? Yeah, she is kinked a little bit, huh? Overall, yeah, she's uh, she's seen a run or two. She's definitely seen some better days. Uh, what took him out on this last one was the steering on this side. Uh, that tie rod broke, which I welded back together. So it'll probably break again since I welded it back together. Um, no radiator in it. No much of anything. That core support, the lower part there where the winch is hooked up was actually touching the bottom of the motor um, up until I used that spot to winch it up onto the trailer um, so basically I mean you can see that's what I'll be hitting with we'll walk around to the other side there Oop. my fat hinder ain't fitting over there we'll climb up here <coughs> all right this side equally as a uh, as bent. She's uh, certainly seen some better days. Good passenger door hit. Remember the quote from Adam when he took this hit in Lodi. I never understood why people would ever want to hit you in the passenger door. It doesn't seem to really do much. Well, he said after this one he understood because it shook his brain when he got hit with this one. Definitely was a pretty good hit. Both tires on the back are flat. Um, I'm not even going to change them. I've got, I got the steering fixed and I can put a new pump back in it and tank because we had pulled it out for other cars. Um, I'm just going to leave these tires on because as of right now, I mean we may work on this yet, but as of right now this car's got no brakes, um, which is not something I'm a fan of. I always have at least one brake in my cars and I feel it's dangerous to not have brakes when you're driving through the pits and stuff. So. I figure what the hell if I got a car that crab walks. I mean, take a look at the angle on that thing. <laughs> this car's better, definitely seen better days. Um, but if it crab walks as bad as this thing does and it's got a couple flat tires, um, hopefully she should kind of stop herself as we're driving through the pits and stuff. So I'm just going to deal with it. Um, this car isn't something that's going to be trying to go out and win another trophy. Um, no water in it. She's been overheated at least twice. Um, the motor knocks real hard when you're trying to start it up. It does not, it does not want to continue to live, but it keeps firing back up anyway. Um, so I'm gonna go give her another run. Uh, why? Because I've been having a lot of fun with these last couple shows, with just trying to get rid of some cars for the off season. You know, put the put the foot down, and you know, if I make one hit with this car, that'd be good enough for me. I don't care. Um, you know, like I said, this is this is step one of my project, Rochelt, and this is not going to be the only step. So. You guys will have more yet coming, um, probably more videos today yet even. Um, I'm in the process of loading all the Jim Falls stuff right now, but I'll make sure that this thing gets in there too so that you guys can uh, see what we're planning on heading to Rochelle with. So appreciate you following along. Hope you guys are enjoying the Jim Falls shows. I'll throw this one up here somewhere in the middle. Um, we're going to get this thing ready to roll. I'm going to take this down and put it at a buddy's house that lives really close to Rochelle. I'm going to put it down there so it's in storage because we're going to have, there may be some extra trips need to be made. I don't know. Adam thinks I'm crazy for running this car again in the shape that she's in. What do you guys think? Am I crazy? Throw a comment down on the bottom. I'd like to hear what everybody else thinks of this uh, beautiful gem we have here. 
Appreciate you guys following along. As always, get goosed.